Aren't you tired of quiet luxury? Shout out to Beyonce for the sacred hair products. Hi, my name is Olu and welcome to my channel. Today we will be doing my global summer haul. Okay, first things first is that today I'm wearing Ophir. I don't even know if that's the way you pronounce it, but I will tag the brand down below. I'm obsessed. I bought it during Black Friday sales when it was 50 to 60% off. But no, I love this dress. I've probably worn it at least 30 times. I've washed it normally and the color has stayed intact. Let's get right. <laughs> Let's get right on into it because I actually need to put all these things in my suitcase. Box number one, I think this is Skims. I'm really happy that these brands have figured out that people will steal our packages if you write the brand on top. And I was right. So I got four things from Skims, I believe. I'm in two separate orders because I've been sitting on these packages for a while now. This first one is the strapless thong bodysuit. I have a couple of strapless dresses that I've never worn because I didn't have the right undergarments. I know it looks so tiny, believe me. These are the best undergarments on the market right now that I've tried at least. And I've tried pretty much all of them, like I'm a girl. And it comes with some straps. And obviously I got it in cocoa, which is the closest match to my skin. I got a light, like my very first batch of skins. I got pink and like a cream color. And you can see it under every dress, but these ones you can't see at all. It's really made like the mesh dress, like a dress like this experience so much better. Ooh, cute, this came in a little bag of its own. This item is the waist train because I really want it to be extra. Oh my God, that looks so tiny. I want it to be extra snatched. And this said it was my size. I'm a little nervous now, but I'm gonna try it. And now I think I can put like all of my Skims undergarments in here. That's fine. We love that. And then I have two more that I'm taking with me, so I guess I'll put them in here too. I think that this is the second Skims box. I'm right again. Okay, I got a bodysuit in purple and lavender. Like I said in the very first video, I like to make sure that I have three things that could go with an item before I buy it. And a lavender bodysuit, you can wear this with denim, you can wear this with a mini skirt. I actually have, first of all, my love for Love Shack fancy skirts is unparalleled. But I have a lavender skirt, and so this will go with that. It will go with jeans, it will go with white, it will go with black. So yeah, there's that. This next one is the seamless sculpt thong bodysuit. It's the same as the one that I just showed you, but this one has the arm strap. So I could wear it underneath a dress like this and you wouldn't even be able to tell that there's something beneath. I know they look so small, but they fit really well. Okay, Reformation. I've been stalking this skirt for at least six months. It never went on sale, ever. Not even during Black Friday. If it went on sale, I didn't see it. It's a beautiful, beautiful color. It was called Pear. It's my length, actually. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm gonna pair this white, brown, green. I literally have all the colors that could possibly go with this dress. And it's made out of actual silk, which is why I actually got it, because I had that blue one, you know, that I wore to Martha's Vineyard last year, but that one was polyester, and it started to get those little balls, I forget what they're, it started to peel after about four washes, useless. So I'm really grateful to have that one so that I can wear it for a long period of time. Okay, this one. Yeah, none of these have the brand names on them at all. Oh my god. I, you know what? Obviously I knew that I bought these things, but I am so excited. This is my first pair of luxury flats. Okay, so the thing is, since COVID, I really believe that New York is just getting out of COVID like this year officially. And I realized that I only have like gym sneakers and heels. I have no flats and I wanted more flats, but I needed a quality flat. The last time I had flats was from LeFleur Randall and it only lasted me like one summer. So I'm hoping that <laughs> that this will last a little bit longer. Fingers crossed. These are the tribute sandals. Okay. Oh, the tribute sandals in cashmere. Is that really the name of the color? That's, that's actually very cute. But <sighs> no, I'm so excited. What if they don't fit and I'm leaving in two hours? Okay. I love them. They're so soft. Oh my god. 
I got these over the Hermes Orans because everybody knows what those look like and I don't want anybody to be able to spot me out and be like, mm, those shoes, like I know them. And then there are a lot of dupes of those shoes. I don't want to be part of that category either. But the thing is, these are a pair of shoes that if you know, you know okay it's like a real fashion girl shoe nobody knows unless you know the history of this shape you know the tribute heel you know that this is a classic ysl shoe i hope it fits oh my god i would be devastated because i don't have time to return them perfect the thing is they didn't have half sizes and i'm a proper 41 and a half and they only come in 41s okay so my feet look crazy because i'm waiting till i get back to get my feet done oh even one of my feet is longer than the other so the other shoe it actually is perfect so i can't show you my feet god forbid because of these i actually got a bag to match them and i think earlier i was talking about looking into like what i was missing in my closet i have no flats and i had no brown shoe i also have no brown bag so i got a brown bag as well oh i mean they smell like leather and they come with their own dust bags perfect because they're getting thrown in my suitcase right now the next package Norma Kamali, an American brand, I believe. So we've got Saint Laurent, which is a European brand. We had Skims, which was American. Norma Kamali, I want to say is American. Cute. This is what I'm talking about. I am such a fabrication person. Oh my gosh, that feels so beautiful. Oh my god. It actually looks like it might be too big. Oh my gosh. No. No. Oh my gosh. We'll see. We'll see. Oh my gosh. The bottom is like a double faced. I'm such a happy camper. Because I was contemplating getting the jacket as well. I'm really on this like suiting kick, but I wasn't sure if they're sizing. And based on those pants, I would have sized down in the pants and I would have gotten the jacket in a smaller size too. So I'm glad I didn't get both of them, but trying one at a time. This package is... And other stories. Mm, another pair of shoes. Like I said earlier, I don't have any flats. And it's been really strange wearing like a dress like this outside with a pair of sneakers. It doesn't make sense. So I got some loafers. Cute. Cute, cute, cute. And this is just like your everyday basic. It's really popular. And so it sells out pretty often on And Other Stories. I'm just checking to see if it fits. Ooh. Oh, that's going to be painful to break in, but it's gonna fit eventually. Oh, my feet look so cute in them. Fine, I'll suffer a little bit. I'm pretty sure this is the most exciting thing to me that I purchased. Via. This is from Luisa Villaroma. Yeah, this is an Italian brand. I was influenced to buy this bag by Christina Fabiana on YouTube. I'll link her down below. She's into the quiet luxury aesthetic. So don't be expecting somebody who's like me. I saw this bag on her and I think she got the chocolate brown one and I had to have it. The thing is, I wasn't sure whether I should get the chocolate brown, the light brown, or the marine color. However, one of the bags went on sale and I'm pretty sure it was a mistake because it was only on sale, it was like 50% off for I had to say like at two hours. I literally bought it on the spot and the price went right back up. It's like me purchasing it, like it alerted somebody that the price was wrong because it hasn't been on sale since. Oh, oh no. I mean, I know that will come out, but that's so sad. Okay, it's gonna fix itself. It's not a big deal. <laughs> yeah, she's so pretty. Imagine, a white summer dress, this bag with these shoes. Okay, so I will say that they look like they don't match right now, but the thing about real leather is that it's gonna patina and it's gonna get darker. And at that point, they will match. But also, like, they don't need to be matchy-matchy. They just kind of need to go together. And browns and browns are in the same family. This is very cute. Not too big, not too small. Oh my God, this is so dusty. Why I didn't just use a cutter is beyond me. 
now. So this is what I'm saying. Like, I think there's some sort of rule happening because they used to ship this bag just like this. What I have is not like remarkable to me. It was just such great quality that I bought more. They never used to ship it in another bag. And this bag is disgusting, quite, to be quite honest. Okay. So it's that top, I'll post a photo here, obviously. It's like really difficult to decipher, <laughs> but on the body, you guys have seen this before. I had it in green and red. It is actually stunning. I tried to get it from Fashion Nova. It was that purchase from Fashion Nova where I actually checked the tag and saw, just read the tag. Let me not even spoil it for you. If you have something from Fashion Nova, go and read the tag. Not the one in the back with the sizing on the side. Go ahead and read it. If you live in California, you can't even get anything from Fashion Nova. Okay, I got these pants, which will make sense. Obviously, I will put a picture right here, but I got these pants because one, I need more pants, and two, I got two shirts, two tunics, I wanna say. I also wear them as dresses that did not come, like I had already taken them out of the box long before I knew I was gonna shoot this video, but that is specifically for that item. We're gonna get to it in a second, and it is from Africa. If you know me in real life, you know that this is my signature style. I have six or seven of these skirts. So join me in the embarrassment of opening up my seventh one. <laughs> but this one is actually different from the other ones. And I got it 138 off of 265. That's about 50% off. Okay, so I'm Isn't it so cute? Like, Come on, packaging. Come on, feminine. I have to say, this is probably the least feminine skirt that I purchased from them, if only by color. So we got this, we got the receipt. They even put it on a hanger. Just a fabulous, fabulous brand. Oh, it broke. Fine. I love these so i have like i said i have about six of them and they're such good quality cotton i actually thought this was gonna be silk for some reason why did i think that let's see if there's a tag inside oh it's viscose i'm okay with viscose actually i mean it's made out of trees really bad on the planet but good for my skin but yeah, I like this a lot. I have a whole bunch of items in this color green, olive green. I even have like an olivey green pair of Manolos. Like I would definitely, are you kidding me? Are you kidding? But I'm gonna style all of these items for you. Is that the last package? Nope, we got one last one. I was actually way too excited to keep this in the box. I got them Dye Lab tunics. I needed a New York black. Obviously, so I can look like an African in New York City and like be cute. If you go to their website, they only sell the long lengths. I asked them to make it 30 inches. So if you want a short one, this is 30 inches. Obviously the same thing in the turquoise color. Now that you've seen this, you can now understand this purchase. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I felt like they would go really nicely together. I don't have any colored pants like this. And I can obviously wear this with white and black, just like a regular t-shirt, and that would go as well. These two tunics are from a brand in Nigeria, in Lagos, where I am going today. This cuckoo is from an, I was gonna say African-American brand, but I guess they're not if they're from the UK. It's a black owned business, black woman owned business in the UK. So I love to support them. Plus the way the garments hold you in so well, like I'm okay with polyester if it's doing a job. If it's just polyester just to be cheap, I'm not here for it because I want to wear my things more than two times. Like I said, I have this in red and green. I've worn the green one at least 15 times. You couldn't tell? Now that I have a black one, are you about to get this every day? <laughs> yeah, I'm about to get out of here.